So most of the time, these wounds and these pain and these memories are like stuck there the way it was experienced. Because it, everything is very relative, right? I mean, something in culturally, something you face, people think, that's oh, no not, not big deal. But other people feel so offended. They can keep that for 10 years. Another person, they can dissolve in one second. Even they did not even notice there's nothing. It's, it's, there's no, they don't impute anything on it. Then whatever it is, it was just sound, it was a light, it was an action, it was some movement. That was, that's all what it is. It just dissolves. But others, they say, wow. How is possible they can say that, do that to me? And that's it. That me is the one big one <laughs> who makes the story, keeps the story, stores it, makes sure it's saved forever. <laughs> right? So that, that's, that's what happens. So until through the practice, something shifts that shifts in that. It stays and it keeps affecting. That's what's happening, right? So, so during practice here, so you go and visit to those people, and then you feel you see them. You see them differently. You don't. You don't. You don't see them horrible. No, you don't. You do feel at least. You don't know. At least maybe you don't know what to make out of them, right? Right. Okay. Who are they? <laughs> Instead of saying horrible, these are the same people. Right? So you get angry at them. You don't feel that. You're like, <laughs> that's at least a good development. <laughs> <laughs> or you feel, oh, I feel empathy for them. You know, sad. My father, my mother, family, friend, politicians. <laughs> yeah. How many people have compassion to Donald Trump? Well, that's a good question, right? I mean, I mean, let's say how many people were angry? Okay, how many people were angry? Okay, how many people changed that anger into a compassion? You see less people, right? That's why you're here. <laughs> or you're working on it, yeah. <laughs> you're working on it. But you can see, you know, I, I definitely feel compassion. I definitely pray. And I definitely, not only compassion to feel prayer, but I maybe sometimes even think there are reasons for it. I mean, there are reasons that we don't know. We, don't, we look at something always from a very negative point of view. We think something very wrong happened. But something, sometimes, sometimes something wrong needed to be happened in order to happen right things. Uh, sun needed to be sad in order for the sun to arise. Sun will never will arise if sun is not sad. <laughs> so if... The condition of sunrise is sunset. So, so some sense of those cycles, the change, uh, it's, a, it's a necessary to people to wake up. And, and, and you can kind of see people waking up. <laughs> <laughs>